All right, so now that we've gone ahead and opened up the kit, we are going to go ahead and start building the robot. So we are going to be building the FTC basic bot. And so you can find the instructions online by simply just going to Google, I'm using my iPad, and just searching up FTC basic bot. And so it should just be the first result that pops up and it's going to be a PDF 35 pages long with instructions. So this is going to tell you how to build the basic bot. So if you scroll down, you'll start on, it looks like page seven. And so, yeah. So I'm going to leave this open and I'm going to be following the instructions and building the bot. And it tells you the parts needed for each page and uh, where to place it and put it in and all that. So let's get to building.
Alright, so I have finished building the basic bot. Here it is. Real simple build. Instructions are fairly easy to follow. You just have to look at the parts. You don't really have to read too much of what the part is. You can just look at it and pick whatever part it is. They aren't that the parts aren't that similar that they're unidentifiable. But here it is. It uses two of the motors, two mechanum wheel, or all of them, um, sorry, all of the Omni wheels, all four of them, and they're grouped in two to make kind of one, and then two of just the regular four inch wheels. And then of course the hub and your 12 volt battery is in there. And there's also a switch. So when you flip this switch, it turns on the hub. And you'll see the blue light there on the left. So when you flip it on, the blue light will be on. Make sure you connect it correctly. And there are a bunch of extension cables for the switch. So you just have to 
uh, to get them and plug them. So one connects to the hub itself and the other connects to the battery. And so it turns it on and off. And yeah, so that's pretty much what's on the basic bot. Next, we will take a look at the block program and get our phone set up so that we can drive this thing.